Hello and welcome everyone, it is me the Laval, also known as the Power to Do List, back for you on the Master Duel Grind. Uh, as you can see, I've reached a bronze 3 off screen. I did one game, um, which really wasn't anything too special. But after, you know, the initial, you know, duels we had in ranked, I have made some changes to the Morphtronic list that we will be piloting for the next couple of games. Uh, as you can see, I cut out the small worlds and the Gizmac in favor of a couple of Ash Blossoms here. Uh, mainly because I really hate Max C. Anyone that follow, follows me on Twitter will probably know that because I've been retweeting Hard Black's quest to get that card banned in this game uh, very, very consistently. But I think with that out of the way, we will move into some more ranked. And I've been like, you know, playing the Legend Anth Anthology event, of course, you know, getting those gems with Mothtronic. Um, and since, you know, there's very limited hand traps in that format, I figured uh, it'd be very important to, you know, run the ones you can. And with, you know, the small words going out of the deck, it was like a fairly easy inclusion. And looking at the hand, it is looking like we will be, we will be doing a bit of linking, uh, especially with this normal summonable Telthorn. Uh, 15 card extra, this might be an actual deck. Um, I'm thinking if I maybe want to like at least summon one of those telephones in uh, defense. To like maybe get uh, a cell phone into rotation. That'd be pretty damn lovely. That's a gadget hauler. Put that to the bottom real quick. Uh, and from here on out, I think we just... Start climbing into an Apollosa first and uh, see where that takes us. Honestly, I think I'll grab this one in defense again and see if I can't, like, nab another name here. That'd be pretty lovely, to be honest. Oh, yeah, cell phone's a really good one because that opens up a lot of lines post uh, making Apollosa. Makes this a whole lot safer in comboing off. I think we'll grab another copy of Telephone here before we actually summon the cell phone back. Uh, we still have, an, have a junk box in hand, so we do have a lot of steam to work with. Uh, I would have liked to roll that 6 off of cell phone, probably. But we'll see what we can get. A 5. 5 is a pretty good number. Caught by Super Magic, Converter, Gamer. No, apparently not. We'll go junk box here. I think we'll directly aim for... No, I think we'll actually grab telephone, funnily enough. Because um, that way we do have a body we can put back with the converter. Because I'd like to keep uh, cell phone on the field. So we cell phone here. We go cell phone effect. One doesn't hit anything. Kind of expected that. So we'll go converter. We'll put this back. Level. Yeah, I think I'll just grab scoping. And then we'll do... Musashi. I think we'll go Musashi for Telephone here, so we have like a, an access code line on the follow-up, because this board might not be as impressive as it, as it could have been. Um, don't have a level 1 tuner here, but I think that is fine. Yeah, I think we'll grab Telephone here, because we make power to... Uh, not getting to braver, but I think that's fine, or that should be fine at least. Because we'll repair unit for Scopen. Summon back Scopen, and I think we just made... We could have made braver, but... I am leaning towards Baron on this one. Uh, 
let's try this. If I get punished for it and Impum loses me the game, that's it, you know. But I think Barone Apollosa is pretty good, especially considering that we basically... Good luck killing me through 10k life points. Uh, and I do have... Uh, no, I am not going to Barone here. I think I'll do that on my turn now. Super Hippo. Is this one of those silly FTKs? Hip Hippo from hand, deck or graveyard, and there's not many Hippo tokens. I think I'll Baron this. Oh, wait. This is probably Inferno Tempest, right? I think I hold the Baron for the Inferno Tempest. Because this, like. 100% is some, you know, silly FTK, right? End phase. Interesting. I am very confused as to... Yeah, we'll go Barone, pop a back row. Interesting. I guess I'll. I guess I'm pitching smartphone here. It pains me to do it. Bring this back on top, and that's a scoop. I really don't know what kind of deck that was. Um, I am. Um, I I think this was like some 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 silly FTK. Yeah, you know, you you play the big kaiju's. There's also an Inferno Tempest in here because we need a win con. Um, yeah, oh, that's a pretty good one to be honest. Uh, we can telephone gain some life. Uh, do a little funny. Maybe draw out an imperm. We'll go south on here. We know what's on top, so we know we're gonna hit. It is always telephone. Oh, we didn't link off the cell phone. <laughs> what am I doing? Actually throwing. Holy shit. Actually clicking buttons. What am I doing? Yeah, I think we'll take a draw here and see what we draw. We still have a lot of gas to go, so I don't mind that in the sliders. Yeah, okay. Now we, you know, maybe play this correctly. Yeah, I think we'll take the south one then. Yeah, if I get mega punished, I get mega punished. I don't really care. Cell phone here, summoning smartphone using the effect. I need to hit a name here to like get to Apple also, which is a bummer, but it is what it is. A oh, boombox is pretty crazy with a lot more resources on the follow up and also makes the board not just like imperm to win, which is pretty nice. Position doesn't really matter here, so couldn't care less. Um, we go Musashi. Uh, I think we Musashi for Telephone here. Oh. I at least want to get to Braver, because Braver Ash feels pretty solid. Or, like, should be pretty solid. Maybe Remote? That'd be pretty sick. Remote would be pretty sick. Right on schedule! Oh, uh, South on itself is also pretty damn solid. I think we'll take that, make Braver. If we like really high roll, we could even make Nat Beast here. If we like remote, we make Nat Beast. A oh, boombox is pretty funny, not gonna lie. I think we make Link Karibo. Do we make Link Karibo? Yeah, let's make Link Karibo. We can swap boombox into attack next turn, anyways. We still have that left so don't really mind that 
And if anything, we'll probably turn our whole board into an access code next turn. Since Braver will have to lose one of the equips. Yeah, that one missed cell phone trigger really screwed us up. That was absolutely atrocious. Circle have to ash this. I hope he doesn't have souls. Souls would be like a tro okay, yep. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, souls would be kind of fucking terrible, wouldn't it, right? If only there was a way how he could get the souls. This just, like, summons DMG. Like, he circles for... Raptorness. Um... Yeah, go off, I guess. Don't really care. Dark magic attack. Okay, that's a wicked one. He wants to crash. Oh, Karibo. You're taking 25 here if you want to get your DMG, uh, your, your DM off the board. Or like at least 12. We convert a boxen into a telephone. He goes eternal soul. Yeah, I don't really give a shit, you know. Don't have a Dark Magician in Grave, so what's the point? Uh, four. I mean, we could also go Remoten and do a bit more, but I think we'll take the, the straightforward line with Telephone here. Guys into a Unicorn, and Unicorn should already, like, spell his demise, to be honest, because we go Unicorn, Pitch Called by... Bounce E Soul and his board goes bye bye. Oh, it's only if it's destroyed. Yeah, I mean, we just pop the DM with access then. Does it make a difference? No. Lynx is so crazy in the deck with Telephone. That's probably why I've like incrementally increased the amount of like bigger Lynx I could, uh, I, I am playing. Just because of like how much added utility you get out of these it's crazy uh we pop dm here just go combat uh yeah i think we just go 3k 53 can't gauze me so Let's go! We beat Dark Magician. <laughs> that sounds a whole lot less impressive than it uh, when you when you really you know mention it. We beat Dark Magician. Oh hell yeah! <laughs> but I think these last couple damn winning two coin tosses and the other time we get made to go first. What is this? The event? <laughs> Oh, there were so many people in the event that were like, yeah, you can, you can, you can go first. I can, I can go second with my blue eyes deck smile. And you just like full combo them. They can't play. It's crazy. Yeah, the event really was uh, an event. Not a huge fan of Legend Anthology, an anthology but uh, a lot of people were. So I guess I am in the minority on that one. Currently, oh yeah, we're picking telephone. We are 100% picking telephone. This time I won't forget making Link Karibo here. Five should be like decently big. Remotens kind of huge. I don't think we just make Apple here, right? We can play so much more if we make Formula, Banish for a one. Yeah, I think that's the that's the line. Yes, we'll formula draw one. I'm just nice like that. <laughs> I will cell phone for cell phone here probably. Uh, well, yeah, cell phone for telephone. Uh, then we'll telephone here. 
I'm on cell phone back. Depending on what we roll here, we could be making up loss on that beast, which is pretty nice. Smartphone reveal converter smile. That'd be pretty dope. Extreme happens. Then we reborn remoten. We remoten banish smartphone. And then we get another smartphone trigger here. Since we can like make earphone. Um, yeah, that sounds good. I like that. That's a good line. Uh, we'll take smartphone here. We still have a telephone in hand, so we're pretty much golden on the follow up. Um, I'm such a huge fan of like keeping a telephone in hand for like a turn four or turn three. Just because of how much uh, like potential telephone has on a like you know in in not only a game state post initial combo but also with like a packed graveyards telephone is so crazy i will go smartphone here make net beast unless we like reveal the nuts here oh convert is pretty crazy <laughs> yeah i think then we're making braver could make og power to grab like now we're making braver we are making braver oh wait i can count it <laughs> i mean even then we have like crystal wing excess and crow option in the baron with like a three met apple so like i don't think we're in a terrible position here uh that does nothing yeah can't do math but it probably doesn't matter because this is like still some like four to five interruptions Retainer. Crazy. Vampires? Sets one. Sets two. Sets three. Sets four. Do it. Set the fort. Do the funny. In phase, okay. Normal summon retainer set for pass. Interesting. Prepare for the flipping of the floodgates. Or Feather Duster. Feather Duster jump scare. I'm very curious to see what back row this is. It's the Vampire Counter Trap. I don't have game on board, so I think what we will do. So we will do a little bit of uh, calling for the boys. Ooh, summon a zombie. Yeah, that's an ash. That is an ash. And I think I'll make... Baron before we, like, do anything else here. Uh, Guardian. Guardian is... Guardian is not fine. That turns off my apple also, actually. That turns off my apple also, actually. Yeah, but this way we just make... Baron and win, right? Because he has, like, no way to interact with anything. Because Baron forces out the last back row, and then we climb into Axis and win, right? It was the El the Golden Land Forever. El Dorado, El Dorado Atlanto is a a different card. Yeah, we'll go telephone here. Quickly assemble the Axis Code Talker. So like that's not a big deal, but. And from here on out, it is as simple as access code target unicorn. And then going access, banish phoenix. Target the guardian. Access code, banish unicorn. 
And that's game. And we did it! We made it to Silvo! <laughs> yeah, I think these, these early ranks will be kind of kind of a stomp up until now. Silver tier 5. Honestly, I really like how this list worked. Um, that is... For sure. Jesus Christ. It's been so long since I've played ranked. Holy. I mean, probably shows, you know. <laughs> I have not been, like, too active on the rank grind. But honestly, with, you know, our icon up there getting updated to the silver one, I think that is as pretty good a point to close this one off as anything. Honestly, I think this worked pretty well. Um, We didn't, like get an ash any max c's but overall i'm very happy with the list and how it performed um but we'll see how long that keeps up and when we like you know maybe need to do some changes to this uh, depending on what awaits us generally i'm you know happy to be playing this deck in md finally um so that's a big w for me and probably why i am on this grind even to begin with but with that out of the way Really, a huge thank you for, like, the amazing support under the last episode, not only in terms of, you know, the views that videos have got has gotten, um, but also, you know, in the comments. A couple, I think, have already left, you know, suggestions for, like, maybe changes. I've read those, specifically the Aurora Dawn idea, but I think as long as this is working well for me and it, it plays well, I like it. I like the, you know, the link toolbox you have here alongside, you know, some very classic synchro options um but once you know we maybe hit a wall i will you know call on you guys to help me break through that wall but we'll see once that happens up until then again a huge thank you to every single one of you who keeps tuning into these um really makes the journey a lot more fun when you know people are out there enjoying it so yeah with that out of the way i will thank you guys very much again but this time for watching See you guys again next time. But until then, goodbye.